dear students in this lecture i am going to teach the second assignment of geotechnical engineering 1 the first question is a metamorphic romp rock formed as a result of high pressure is it is a metamorphic rock formed as a result of high pressure is igneous rocks so the given igneous rocks it is a granite so because of high pressure the metamorphic rock formed as a result of high pressure so it is granite answer a for question number one Coming to question number two, the phenomenon of cavity formation occurs in. So generally cavity formation phenomenon so it will occur in limestone. So answer A for question number one coming coming to question number three which of the following is a freshwater lake deposit generally alluvial soils are running water deposits alluvial soils are running water deposits and lois is aeolian deposit and tough is small grained slightly cemented volcanic ashes transported by water and lacustrine is lake deposit so that is freshwater lake deposit is a lacustrine so answer D for question number 3. Coming to question number 4. Aeolian sands can be used as an aggregate in concrete because of presence of because of presence of calcium carbonate bonds. Because of presence of calcium carbonate bonds the sands formed by aeolian that is by wind action so answer b for question number four coming to question number five thixotropic property is exhibited by generally thixotropic property exhibited so that is thixotropic property means reclamation of strength reclamation of strength of soil when kept under free condition when kept under free condition so regain of strength by soil is called thixotropic property this will be exhibited by montmor this will be exhibited by bentonite clay answer d for question number 5 
coming to question number 6 matching colluvial soils loess tough alluvial so colluvial soils are by gravity force loess is wind force tough is wind or sometimes it is water and alluvial soils is water so matching answer b for question number 6 coming to question number 7 which of the following is our attributes of marine clay deposits so attributes of marine clay deposits attributes of marine clay deposits or they are very soft soils and high moisture content and some they have some organic matter and they, because of all these reasons they are very compressible okay so both a and b are correct attributes of marine clay or a and b so he has given no organic content they are having some organic content coming to question number eight black cotton soils deposits are formed from weathering of so black cotton soil deposits are formed from obviously weathering of which rock it is weathering of basalt rocks so answer c for question number eight question number nine which of the following deposits is susceptible to liquefaction so generally liquefaction will occur in very fine sands and silts so generally very fine and silts are formed by formed from alluvial soils okay so answer a for question number 9 coming to question number 10 the swelling nature of black cotton soils is due to presence of obviously there are three minerals kaolinite illite mont moronolite mont moronolite so because if kaolinite is present swelling is low illite is medium if mont moronolite is present swelling is very high okay so answer a for question number 10 thank you